Hello. Uh, it is currently around noon time. Where are we going, Lauren? Um, we gotta go to Costco to get gas. Uh huh. And then we're going to pick up 85 degrees for Juan. Okay. And then we're gonna go to Tail Town. Tail Town. What's Tail Town? Um, it's a cat cafe, although they don't actually have any like food and drink. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Um, but it's basically you can come and play with the cats, and they partner with a local shelter. Ooh. And they have a lot of cats. Yeah. Like 34 cats. A lot of cuddly cats, huh? Mm -hmm. I hope they have the same ones I saw last time because I want to show Joey them. Oh, okay. And then either before or after Tail Town, depending on when we're hungry, we're going to go get tacos for lunch. Ooh, yay. I'm ready. Me too. And we're going to go to Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. Where are we buying at Trader Joe's? Um, snacks. Snackies? <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't go that often because it's in Pasadena. Uh-huh. Um, so whenever I'm in the area, I want to stop by. Ah. Uh -huh. Maybe a few groceries. Stopped. I see. Yeah, no, that's I'm a good idea. I'm craving one of their snacks, so. Snackies? If we're in the area. I'll what are you craving? Um, Scotcheroos. Scotcheroos? Where are those? It's like a Rice Krispie bar, except uh -huh. it has peanut butter and butterscotch, Ooh. and then there's chocolate on top. I bought ingredients for it at the store. Uh huh. Do you remember? Yeah, I do. Um, but I want to eat Trader Joe's too. I want it all. <laughs> I see. Yeah. Uh, I wasn't planning to go to Trader Joe's, which mm -hmm. is why I bought it at the uh -huh. grocery store. But yeah. if we're gonna be in the area, then might as well just do it. Right, 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 right. So. Might as well buy it. Yep. And okay. then I'll still make it sometime. Nice. I don't know when I, I don't have a lot of time for baking lately. Mm -hmm. And we don't exactly have an oven. So I don't even know when I'll bake it. It could be a month from now. Mm -hmm. But I'll have supplies. Nice. When I do have time. Okay. Yeah. Oh, well, great. We'll see you at the cat cafe. Bye bye. All right, where are we getting Lauren? Oh, let me get the list. <laughs> The list. Can we use this? Yeah, we can. That's Quan's list right there. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. Anybody bread? Toro. Are you sure he wants this egg tart and not that egg I don't know. I mean, we'll get him what he wants. Choco bun is a taro. Oh, you already got that, did you? No. Or is it a different one? Is it ube. Ube. Uh, no. Oh, it's down here. Marble taro? Is that the same thing? No. It's, he wants taro mochi. Taro mochi. We can loop around. Let's go for the other ones. The other ones are cool. Oh, I see. Look at this. All for Kwan. All for Kwan. And this isn't even everything. Yeah. There's one behind the counter and then one we couldn't open. I got this for myself. Oh. Treat myself. You need carbs. I do. For your rents. Yeah, I do. Nice. Nice and safe. I feel like I'm gonna tip over so. Okay. introduced seven new cats. Wow. So they're all still kind of getting to know each other. 
Um, there's toys here if you'd like to play. Always use a toy and not your hands. Okay. Um, you're welcome to pick them up as long as they say it's okay. Okay. Um, and then let us know if you have any questions. Sounds okay, thank good. You. Thank you. Oh. Wow. Hello. Look, they're so sleepy. Hi. Oh, this one has a whole cat condo to himself. Oh, let's see. It's happy. Look, it's happy. It's happy. It's so happy. But it, it also isn't the black one I saw last time. Oh. It must be new. She said they just introduced some cats. This one's really good. He gets his own cat condo. Why does he get his own cat he, condo? I think he doesn't get along as well. Oh. So he I has see. his own space. Hello, Snip. Oh. The tuxedo cat. He likes the pets. Oh. Sniff. He's like a dog. <laughs> he likes the pets. Do you want me to pick you up? No, that's okay. He likes the pets. Wow. Wow. You're in cat heaven. Yeah. This is Eureka. She has different color eyes. You see them? Yeah. How cute. Got a little little feistiness over there. Meow meow. Wow. Ooh, she's so happy. She like ooh. She likes the pets. Oh, you want the pets too? Oh, I've been chosen.
she's purring. That one sat on my lap last time. I'll show you the photo later. Protecting my stuff. Hmm? Yeah. Comfy, huh? Your name's Denver. Denver? See? Do you see it? Yeah. Yeah, he's a big kitty. You're a big boy. Good sniff? Good sniff? Mmm, yeah, you like that. This is the one that was on your Oh, yeah, I think so. Chindo? Chando? Chando? Or Chando? Yeah. There's Eureka. Eureka. Oh, oh Turo. This one was on your shoulder. Oh, I see. Was it? Is it? Yeah. Oh. It's a zoo. He's a zoo. Like the Siamese. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we just uh, finished our, uh, what do you call it, cat? It's a cat cafe, cat but cafe. more like a cat rescue, I guess. Yeah, it's like a cat rescue. There was like 37 cats in there. Yeah, even more than that. And um, yeah, it was, I think it was like super fun. Like all the cats, I feel like all the cats were really, really affectionate. Yeah. They all really enjoyed our company. There were like four or five cats that were all over us. Yeah, especially like the tuxedo cat is just like following us around most yeah. of the time. Um, and yeah, there's a lot of, a lot of purring, a lot of, a lot of sniffing. One so. of the cats jumped on George. Yeah. Yeah. I was not expecting that, honestly. Cause I felt like I felt like they were like rubbing against my back, right? And then the next thing I knew, it I the saw cat him was jump up. yeah. He just went for it. Yeah. Yeah. Next thing I knew, it he was on my shoulders. And there was that one on my lap at the same time. Oh yeah. And then there was that cat at the end that was like all over you. Mhm. Mm Anyways, it's like almost three o'clock. Uh, we gotta get our lunch now. Yeah, we gotta get lunch. Well, we were there for like an hour and a half, almost two hours. Hey, we got our admission 50% off. Yay! It's usually $20 and we got a $10 each. Yay! Because we wrote the review. Yay! No, it was really good. I enjoyed it. I like it better than the dinner. I agree. I don't know, the Denver one just seems like a little... Uh, yeah, it's like either crowded or there's too many people. Yeah, this it's just usually too crowded. Yeah. And their like little shop is cute. In mm -hmm. the front you can get coffee. I actually like being able to get a drink. Uh -huh. um, but it's just like too much. Oh, I see. Space. And not enough cats. I see. We had like 30 cats all to ourselves. Yeah. Sorry. I was like thinking I would go, but then I decided. It's okay. It's okay. Um, it was so fun. It was fun. Very fun. And then when I adopt a cat, eventually I'm gonna get one from there. Get one from there. Yeah, definitely do that. If I was gonna adopt one today, it'd be so hard to decide because there were literally like four cats that were super affectionate. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there were more that were like super soft and friendly. Mm -hmm. I agree. Who was your favorite? Who was my favorite? Mm -hmm. I think maybe the last one that was on my lap. The great one? Yeah. Yeah, that one's Cause like, so cute. Happy's like a lap kitty, but then like she has a like five to ten minute petting quota. Yeah. But then I was petting this cat for like a straight like 15, 20 minutes and. Yeah. And, and then, then it went and just got on my lap. Like yeah. it wasn't even done with cuddling. Yeah, and he was just enjoying it so much. And the toe beans were so pink and cute. Oh yeah, the pink toe beans. It was like your picture book cat. Yeah, I feel like they're all very well trained. Yeah, and then, and then you can tell the owners or whoever manages the cat cafe is like very 
as a big animal lover. Yeah, yeah, that she cares about them, and then any cats that like try to stir things up, that she, she gives can... them, <laughs> she gives them like a timeout yeah. for like half an hour. So she said she'd recently introduced like seven, mm -hmm. seven cats, yeah. so they were still like not getting along with the rest of them, mm -hmm. and they kept like fighting, and she put them in timeout. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, uh, we're off to getting tacos. I'm ready. I'm actually pretty too, hungry. I'm like suddenly really hungry. Yeah. I was I was pretty hungry when I went to the bathroom. Yeah. And then I'm like, well, I'm gonna tough it out for another hour if you if and see when you wanna leave and you Wait. wanted to leave like half an hour later, so Yeah. I was getting ready to go. Yeah. Too. Anyways, we will see you there. Bye bye. You ready, Lauren? Australia number two. <laughs> I'm ready. This reminds me of the place we stopped by in Vegas. In Vegas? Yeah. Ooh, it smells good. Hey, okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. The meat is really tender and juicy. Yeah. You can tell this is corn tortilla. Mm. It's getting too hard to rank individuals. Too hard to rank, yeah. So I think we should start just giving them like S tier, A tier, B tier. Okay. So on. Okay. And then like, tell me what you think the minimum tier is for an LA to be <clears throat> the LA <clears throat> standard or the chewy standard for an LA taco truck. Oh, definitely a B, <laughs> LA standard. Okay. Definitely a B. And then, do you have an example of an S tier? S tier, S tier would probably be Leo's or like um, La Ulica, uh, the birria there, <clears throat> and also like that like um, that taco truck that you found. I don't remember what oh, it yeah, was the called. One that was super ghetto by the dollar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was yeah. Okay. Yeah. What, where do you rank the name? Tier list. La Estrella, I would rank it a B tier. Oh. I would say it's a B tier. Okay. It's not quite A because, you know, like I like to build my own tacos mm -hmm. and put my own salsa on there. So the one that we got today, they already like got the cilantro and onions on there, which is a fine, but they also like sprinkled the. <clears throat> the salsa on there already. I agree with you because I actually wanted a little less salsa. Yeah. Um, they didn't put a lot, but then like, if it was like the red one, the red salsa might be a little too spicy for Lauren. Like, I mean, I can handle it. I love the red one, but... But yeah, the... <clears throat> the green salsa was like... Yeah, it's just green salsa. It wasn't really much. Um flavor to it but it was it was good <clears throat> but other than that I just felt like it was good but um it was the dilemma like you know the other place the food truck place where it was they pre-made everything um you don't really like get to build your own or like make it the way that you want it to taste like because like <clears throat> you can have like 
more or less salsa increase or decrease the flavor so um so yeah for me i think it's b tier what about you lauren um i think it definitely meets the standard yeah that we have oh, i need to turn or no, i need to not turn mm -hmm. okay. <clears throat> it definitely meets the standard um if they didn't put the salsa on for me i was actually gonna give it an a tier yeah it would have been like b plus or a tier yeah. but. um what do you think the one by my house the one by your house yeah. i'm gonna say it's a low-key s tier wait really yeah why is it an s tier it's s tier because okay here first it's like convenience okay. number two <laughs> is the um the fact that it's like like almost like true street tacos right yeah. everything is out in the air like who knows if flies f landed on it or whatever but hey you know what i'm reading it and it's uh, all in the big bucket. yeah yeah like like all the condiments like the onions the cilantro oh and they had uh pickled onions which a lot of i feel like a lot of places don't really have it or they don't you know what i like <clears throat> What? When they have the big meat on the... The El Pastor? Yeah, but then what makes it even better is on the top of the rod, they also have the pineapple. Yes, and exactly. And they take the same knife they and put, they cut them Okay, off. the thing, you, they didn't have pineapples on the El Pastor today, okay? Yeah, when we went there before, they've, they've had the pineapple on top uh -huh. of the meat, and then they take the same yeah, knife and like, exactly. like this. See, okay, you know what? Like, the one right by your house... If you order Al Pastor, they fire, like, they they do, like, an extreme flame to, like, char the meat before they, like, slice it off. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah, that's something that, you know, it, it just enhances, like, oh, they're making it, like, extra good for me, you know? For me, they don't have birria or mm -hmm. gyros. Yeah. Like, it wasn't going to be S tier. Oh, I see. It's, like, convenient location almost on campus, only, like, two yeah. minutes from my house, and then mm -hmm. the like, it was for sure a solid A. Ah, I see, I yeah. see. So S tier for you, you need churros? Um, it's not a requirement, but it's a guaranteed. Oh, it's an guaranteed okay, I see now. Yeah. I see now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, the one by your house is actually low-key S tier for me. <laughs> yeah. Um... But yeah, other than that, pretty good. We're just going to Trader Joe's. Yeah, just the um, quick stop, and then we'll be back home. Yep. We'll be back home and chilling for the rest of the day. You cold? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, guess what? We're, we're in the freezer section. Mm -hmm. You need to look for ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> ice cream's right there. I knew it. You made your way back to the ice cream section. <laughs> I'm for sure gonna get one of those. Oh, get the mochi. Oh. Get more. I definitely could, but should Macarons? You want no, some macarons? I actually don't like macarons. Oh, you don't like them? Oh look, ice cream down there. You got a cone. Ooh, look at that French vanilla. I could go crazy. Cookie butter? Wait, you like cookie butter, right? Yeah. Yeah. But I, I shouldn't. No, you shouldn't. Do you want me to buy it for you? I'll buy it for you. Oh, Chef Lauren. Hi. What do we have? Let me pause this. Oh, pause. Look, I only had two minutes. It's wow. Fine. You're um, so productive. No, are you not getting anything out of this? Like, okay, before I started cooking, uh -huh. I started cooking because I realized I wasn't getting anything out of it. Oh, I see. Besides hearing what I should be learning about, uh -huh. because there's too much stuff on the slides. I bet. Like, the slides make no sense to me. Uh -huh. I'm gonna have to go to YouTube and learn it instead. Dang. Um, anyway, we have some rice. Wow. They have some wild rice. Okay, okay. Um, fish. fish. And then I put these in the air fryer, but they got a little burnt. Oh, um, that's okay. Okay, so time to eat. Nice, time to eat. Good? Mm hmm. 
Let's see. Mm. Mm. Ten out of ten. Okay, two more minutes. Just finishing lecture. We're on our walk right now. Um, Lauren's on a mission to look for some kitties, neighborhood yeah. kitties. The black one came up to our balcony yesterday. Yeah. At like 2.30. Mm hmm And last time Joy was here, we did find one of them. It mm -hmm. was Smokey. Smokey. Or Whiskers, I can't remember. Yeah. So... Today, hopefully, we find the rest. Yeah. I got some treats. She's trying to lure them. Yeah. <laughs> Have a chew or two. Yeah. Well, anyways, hopefully, we find them. Yeah, I hope so. Yeah. <laughs> we found the kitty. Oh, someone fed it some uh, canned food. He ate the frisbees. Oh. Yeah, put it in, in his uh Dang you gave him half your treats. Yeah. Okay. Shall we keep walking and uh, see if there's any other kitties? I mean, I don't know if we'll find them. Stay a moment? Okay. I don't think he's gonna come. Oh. He's like, can you leave so I, I can eat? So we only saw Whiskers today. Yeah, same cat Joey saw last time. Yeah. He's the most reliable, I guess. Mm-hmm. That's okay. We left him some treats. He hadn't mm -hmm. eaten them yet, but there's some people around, so he's kind of hiding. Yeah. I bet he'll eat them later. I bet so too. Anyways, I gotta start packing and prep to leave. No. It's okay. Till next time. Bye bye.